and one of the most remarkable stories, Ya Ikhwani, I have heard with this regards, is a story of a woman who lives in the city of Mansoura in Egypt. A lady who said that I came from a very poor family. And her husband was absent for one reason or another. And she said, my daughter became very ill on one particular evening and she began to fever like never before. And I could do nothing for her, I have no money for food. We spent that evening hungry, let alone buy her medication. And I would pray two rak'at to Allah Almighty, two units and call upon Him and attend to my daughter. And pray and call and place my trust in Him and call to my daughter. Attend to my daughter. And the hours would pass, it was now midnight, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock in the morning, then they hear a knock on the door. Who is it? It's the doctor. It's the doctor. So the lady, she puts on her hijab. She opens the door. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Where is the girl? He says. The lady, she says, she's in the room. Allahu Akbar, who sent him? He comes into the room. He checks her. Prescribes for her medication. And then leaves the house. And he says, payment please. Payment. And the woman began to cry. She said, doctor, I don't have anything to pay you with. He said, what do you mean? How rude of you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Don't you have any shyness? You call me in this late hour of the night to attend to your daughter and you know you have no wealth to pay me. She said, Doctor, Wallahi, I didn't call you. I don't even have enough money to buy a phone. We haven't even eaten this evening. He said to her, what do you mean you didn't call me? Is this not door number such and such? She said, no, that's the door next door. The doctor, he began to weep because he understood that this was Allah who sent him their way. He said, please, let me go back inside. What is your story? Who are you? How did this happen? And she explained the story. He understood. So he bought them food for that evening. And he went and he purchased and delivered the medication himself. And he gave her a monthly wage as well. Man وَمَنْ ذَا الَّذِي دَعَى اللَّهَ فَلَمْ يُجِبْهِ وَمَنْ ذَا الَّذِي تَوَكَّلَ عَلَيْهِ فَلَمْ يَكْفِهِ أَلَيْسَ اللَّهُ بِكَافٍ عَبْدَهِ بَلَى وَرَبِّهِ And I'm sure that if I ask any one of these brothers to mention a similar story, you could. When you needed Allah, you had nobody to ask but Him, and you were given.